At this point, I decided to bring the song into Logic to flesh out the sound some more, since I really like the Logic instruments and mixing and mastering tools. Although I went through many other sessions in between, this session is the final session prior to mastering. The structure is still similar, but I've added a bunch of elements that are different and sound more polished. The main thing that was added was a bunch of different layers of violin that I recorded in Logic. I rented some quality microphones like the Coles 4038 and Royer R121 ribbon mics and the Neve 1073 preamp to enhance the sound quality. I added a new synth, the Arturia CS80V, which sounds just brilliant. I love the evolving quality of this sound. I also added some Tycho drums from my EXS library to add to the drama of the piece. I changed the drums because I wasn't feeling as avant-garde a year later and wanted a more down-tempo vibe. I used Logic's Ultra Beat for this, which I love because it has a step sequencer. Step sequencers just make everything so much easier. And Ultra Beats is great because you can see all of the steps at the same time. I added a few vocal samples from the EXS instrument in Logic to complement Kathy's vocals as well. The sound effect rise in the breakdown is from Rob Pappin's Predator. There are a bunch of great sound effect presets in that instrument. At this point, I was just trying to make it sound as epic as possible. I mixed the final stems at my friend Henry Strange's studio, and we used his Universal Audio plugins to sweeten the sounds of the tracks, as well as a lot of the Logic plugins like the EQ, Ring Shifter, and Tape Delay, as well as Rob Pappin's RP Verb on the violin. RP Verb is a brilliant new reverb I've been using quite a bit in my live shows because of the low CPU footprint, as well as in the studio for the clean, beautiful sound and loads of preset choices. After we mixed the song, I sent it off for mastering at Audible Oddities, and once mastered, I sent the track over to Scott Pagano, who created this amazing video for Pororoca. To see the Pororoca video, watch the final video in this series.